you know, the, the reality is that he is the one who is engaged in this kind of anti-migrant rhetoric um, that is pressing people like the El Paso shooter to uh, the margins, who are then going and reading uh, theories of the Great Replacement that inspired, for example, the Christchurch shooter as well, reading these documents online, and then jumping into action. The, if you read, and, and uh, unfortunately, I think people should read uh, the manifesto of the El Paso shooter, because you see exactly that this is Trump's rhetoric. Um, but it's also the rhetoric of border control that's been, uh, you know, that's been, you know, per, pervade for, for decades under Democrats, under Republicans. It's the kind of rhetoric that tacitly allows uh, these things to happen. CNN, not just Fox News, Tucker Carlson, of course, is a great purveyor of the myth of white genocide and white replacement. But CNN uh, ran a headline about the disappearance of white America. These are the kind of things that passively uh, allow um, this paranoia to seep into a mainstream white America. America, that in a context of devastation economically, in a context of economic suffering, um, allows people to be mobilized, to be radicalized um, by these white nationalist organizations, which are spreading, which are using the internet, and which are encouraging people through 8chan, which luckily it looks like has been weakened, encouraging people to engage in these kind of attacks.